Welcome to Room 6, the channel dedicated to the local music scene and the people that make it, including me. I'm Josh, and today I'm reviewing yet another songwriter showcase at Soul Belly Barbecue, hosted by friend of the channel, Hal Savar. If you'd like to be on the showcase, contact Hal using the social media links that I put in the description. If you'd like to be reviewed or interviewed, or both, by me, hit me up using the email address or social media link for Room 6 down there. You'll find those and other ways you can support the channel. Now then, let's enjoy some great food and awesome music, shall we? Oh, and uh, bring some napkins, would you? This could get sticky. Hal was nice enough to let me open the show again, so I grabbed Room 6 alumni Russ LaCasse's guitar and gave it a whirl. Once that was done, Hal took over the mic and showed the crowd what a real showman was. Hal's really trying to grow the local music scene into something awesome, which is nice. No, 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 no! Hal unveiled a new song, which blended some clever lyrics with his trademarked powerhouse vocals and a little slower pace than his usual fare. I'm very fortunate to call him and most of the performers of the evening Room 6 alumni. The rest of his set was just as powerful and a great way to open up the night. Coming up next was Russ LaCasse, two-time Grammy recommended songwriter extraordinaire. Russ made the trek all the way from Arizona to perform and the crowd was glad he did. Blending some wry humor with southwestern twang, Russ writes songs designed to tell a story, whether true or not. You can see why Nashville musicians seek him out for his tunes. Due to some last-minute lineup changes, Quinn Turner surprised everyone by jumping on stage for a bit. Quinn's music is positive and wistful, combining a little peace and love and a little longing for some sweet lovin'. I'm glad he was able to make it. After Quinn, Hal took the stage again to give the next act time to prepare. This involved some of Hal's patented banter and amazing songs as well. The next act was Krista Kidd, and I'm looking forward to getting her on the channel soon. Krista's songwriting is soulful and heartfelt, combining emotional memories with cathartic vocals. If you've ever felt anything ever about anything, you'll find something in her music to relate to. Continuing the trend of surprise songwriters for the night, taking the stage next was Krista's good friend, Jeff. His stage name? Just Jeff. No, really. Jeff's only been songwriting for about three months, but you wouldn't know it to hear him play. His music was lighthearted yet touched on some relatable, everyday topics, and he really impressed everyone there with how far he's come in such a short time. I'm happy to announce he'll be coming on the channel soon, and next month actually, and I can't wait to see what he's come up with by then. Next batter up was Chalmer Harper, with Chris Massa on lead guitar. Chalmer is no shy wallflower on stage, belting his lyrics to the heavens while strumming his guitar almost angrily as Chris noodles and solos on his electric guitar. The duo also treated everyone to a new song written by Chris and sung by Chalmer. They're always great to watch. Hal finished out the night with another song or two before everyone went home to celebrate the holiday in their own way. Overall, the fourth installment of the Songwriter Showcase at Soul Belly Barbecue went great, and I'm looking forward to my next visit there. Hope to see you there or on the live stream. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope that you'll swing by Soul Belly Barbecue if you find yourself in the neighborhood of Main Street in downtown Las Vegas. And I hope that we'll see you at a showcase here soon on Sundays, 7 p.m. Um, or on the live stream, 7, 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Um, oh yeah, like I said, if you want to be on the channel, hit me up. If you want to be on the showcase, hit up Hal. If you want to support the channel, please use that Room 6 social media link. It's where you can find room6.shop for merch. Um, my own two CDs, as well as the Patreon page. It all goes to help out the scene, including the Room 6 Rocks Summer Showcase coming up on August 6th at Chiba Hut on Rainbow and Sahara. This is my opportunity to say thank you to some of the past uh, interview guests. Uh, they get to pr basically put on a full show and have their merch out there, introduce themselves to uh, fans that, you know, wouldn't normally see them based on, you know, the bands that are playing that night. Um, what else? Oh, yeah. If you want to see more videos like this, please click up here. And if you'd like to subscribe, please click down there. Don't forget to ring the bell. It really does make a difference. I'd appreciate you. Remember to be amazing, and we'll see you next time on Room 6.